pretty much means you would say she's a right, right, about a funny or outrageous person. Ah, I get it, I get it. Is, is that like a Canadian term? Because I've never heard that before. Ku was here before me. Yes, Ku would have been the OG, like the real OG. Fuck Uber and the snitches, yeah. Probably Karen's. Why did you get banned on Uber? Because I was streaming. That's why. British? Is it is it British? A bunch of other streamers started copying Gus, but they were violating people. They weren't doing it right, so Uber blanket banned the entire thing. I don't know, I thought that was a well-known term, but yeah. Yeah, I, I've never heard that. I mean, in California, I've never heard that. Maybe in other parts of the U.S. or maybe the U.K., but I've, I've never heard that before. Um, no, no, no. I mean, here's the thing. It's my, it's, I'm an I'm a, um, independent contractor for Uber. It is my car. Uber does not own the car. So I had a right to have a camera in there. And the thing is, I told everybody that got in my car, I explained it to them, hey, I am live streaming on Twitch. Are you okay with it? Like I made sure I told them what I was doing. I explained to them I was streaming. They had to say yes in order to get the right for me. If they said no, I would have not, I would not put them on camera or I would cancel the ride or whatever. But anyone that, that was on my camera, on my stream, they all agreed to it. So some people would just agree to it, but deep down they did not, you know, like they'll say, yes, I agree. Take the ride. And then later when they finish the ride, one star or report me to Uber, like, this guy was recording me on the internet, I, did, I didn't agree to it, or, you know, like, it's stupid, some people just did that, and, uh, <clears throat> I think I, I was streaming for, like, three months on, on Uber, and I, and I got banned, and it was getting so big that eventually I was getting, like, four or five hundred viewers on Twitch, like that's how that's how big it was getting. Like I went from like 10 viewers to 500 viewers on average in just three months. And then I got banned on Uber. So then I, I kind of stopped, you know. <clears throat> I've seen some nasty shit and accusations towards Uber and Lyft drivers. They get treated like shit from people, yeah. That's true. Like. Some people just lie to Uber because they'll get their money back. Like people like, oh, I want to get a refund. I'm going to report this guy. Like they don't think about like these people are working to make a living. They just care about themselves. They want to get their $10 back and make this guy lose his job. You know, some people are scandalous, you know, oh no, I just ignored someone in chat by mistake. I don't know who it was, but it says user successfully ignored. Whoa, that's not good. You did the most non-cam drives I've ever seen. You turned camera out and it was beautiful. Yeah, yeah, I did that for a long time on Lyft because I, I didn't want to stream people on Lyft anymore. Um, but I still got banned. In March 2020, I got banned on, on Lyft. Right before I came back, like exactly like, like four days before I came back to Thailand, I got banned on Lyft. <clears throat> it was legit, they were hating. You're right, Gus. I would not want to be on stream while in the Uber, to be honest. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's your choice. I mean, if you didn't want to be on stream, I would have faced the camera out towards the road and not towards you. And I would have muted the microphone so that nobody in the stream could hear you. But even then, people were paranoid. Like, they, even though I told them, okay, the stream is muted, they cannot see you, they cannot hear you, people were still like freaking out and like thought I was still recording them. And then they still reported me, you know? <clears throat> uh, BAM's Wednesday Instagram stream ended at 5 a.m. involuntarily with the struggle over the phone. Oh. Yeah, I didn't see that one, but yeah, I, I'm glad to see that she's okay now. 
Food delivery, fair enough, but having people in the car streaming, yeah, I can, yeah, I, I completely understand. And that's why I always told people what I was doing and I gave them the choice of me muting the mic and facing the camera towards the road. So I gave people the choice of privacy or I give them the choice to cancel without charging them a cancellation fee. So I, I was being, I was trying to accommodate everyone. If you're okay with being on stream or I can not stream you and mute it or I could cancel the ride for you and not charge you, you know? I mean, I, I gave people choices and some people agreed to stuff and they still didn't like it. So I don't, you know, I, I completely understand. <clears throat> Gus is one of the hottest up and coming live streamers. Other streamers also reported his content. <laughs> yeah, it's stupid. I saw you message and let people know you had a cameo. Yeah. yeah, I would even, when I got the request, I, I would even send them a text message before I picked them up so I wouldn't waste their time. Like, I would send a message and be like, hey, I'm, this is what I'm doing. Are you okay with it? A lot of people even replied saying, yes, I'm okay. Or like some people would cancel the ride even before I got there. So, I mean, there was a lot of warning and opportunity. <coughs> yeah, I never, I never filmed anyone against their will. Never, never. Drunk people throw up in your car. Yeah, I, and I've, I've got it on stream too. People throwing up. I don't even know how you ignore someone in chat, but yeah. Vice versa, a lot of people really enjoy the streaming experience. Yeah, I made a lot of, like, I met a lot of good people on Uber and Lyft th through the through the stream and stuff. It was it was pretty cool. I'm sure there's some of, there's, like, a lot of the people that were on my Uber rides actually followed me as a, as a Twitch viewer, you know? And I'm sure there's still a few that still follow me and probably watch me. They probably don't even talk in chat, but I'm sure there's some still in here. Maybe not right now, but yeah. If you grew so fast, probably some other streamers were jealous and reported you. I know a streamer that is reporting other streamers that are <clears throat> online 24 plus for unhealthy practice, yeah. I mean like, yeah, Cash Meow, he's one of those people that stream 30 hours every time. I'm sure, I'm sure people report him just for the fact that he's streaming over 24 hours, you know, but nothing's, nothing has ever happened from Twitch against Cashmere. I mean, it's kind of stupid that people would report stuff like that. Yeah, they have